Thank you guys. Uh, thanks a lot for coming back. And I'm sorry, I don't know what is wrong with Zoom, but it kicked me out. So I was trying to, to come back as soon as possible. Okay, so um, with that being said, that was a really nice one, guys. Uh, thanks everybody for sharing your opinion on the, oh, okay. Oh, Consuelo's computer is off, okay. So um, thanks for sharing your experiences, you know, and, and your opinion on these things of diet, exercise and everything. Um, that is really good to hear. Um, people, questions. Do you have any questions with the vocabulary we just checked? Uh, we just checked a couple of words like workout, that is super common, uh, cool down, warm up, you know, aerobics. Any question with those words? How do you say gastritis? Oh, that would be gastritis. You write it the same way, but you pronounce it a little different. So that is gastritis. Uh, normally, um, some like pains are this way. For example, uh, when you say colitis, the same thing, colitis, gastritis, colitis. Um, how do you call the one that you get in your ears? I mean, in your eyes, that your eye gets red. And, oh, forgot it. Conjunctivitis. Yes, that one, thank you. So same thing, it's conjunctivitis. So that would be iris too. Mm -hmm. All the ones that finish in iris, that would be iris. Mm -hmm. Okay. Anything else? How to say perder peso. Uh, that that would be, yeah, lose. Uh, lose weight. Lose. You can use uh, you can use the word loss, um, pero hay una pequeña diferencia. Lose weight is like the activity, right? Like estoy perdiendo peso, I am losing weight. Um, Se si utiliza la palabra loss, so tendría que ser weight loss como la pérdida de peso. So se usa un poquito diferente, uh, mm -hmm. but la actividad como estoy en proceso, estoy perdiendo, that would be lose. I'm losing weight. Lose weight, okay. That would be lose. Thank you. Welcome. I creo que you must have another question. I think I heard a girl. Me, teacher. Um, only when I looking for information about diets, I uh, find um word for me is new. The this is this is. This is same day illness. Yes, yes. Um, so you can use the word disease. Um, you can use the word illness, or you can use the word sickness. So all of them refer to enfermedades, right? So illness, diseases, or sickness. Mm -hmm. That's right. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Anybody else? Or are we good? Disease, illness, sickness is the same issues. Yes. Um, so normally in English, yes, we can use exactly the same the same expression. So okay. illness, disease. Give me one second, guys. Solo me están pidiendo a soporte, like the the issue. Sorry about that. All right, guys, nice. So that is like super cool. I'm very happy because uh, you're trying to communicate your ideas. You're trying to say them in English. So very good job with that. Now, but el día de mañana, guys, for tomorrow, uh, let's say that I have kind of a hard topic. Eh, que es el uso de pasados. Yo sé que ya se fue los pasados, you know, I know that you have been studying and checking past tenses all the way, but al momento de usar los pasados siempre se complican for any reason, you know. 
sorry about that. <laughs> okay, so what we are going to be doing is the following. Uh, guys, solo les voy a pedir, I'm just going to ask you, um, ¿tiene lista de verbos? Do you have a list of verbs? Were you giving a list of verbs before? Ya revisaron pasados, right? You already checked past yes. verbos en pasado. Uh, en algún momento les dieron lista? Did you have like a list of verbs of yeah, simple past? No se recuerdan? You don't remember? I remember, yes. Do you still have it? Okay, vamos a hacer lo siguiente. Let's do the following. Les voy a compartir una lista de 10 um, verbos. Vamos a comenzar little by little. En caso que no se recuerden, that you have forgotten them. So, I'm going to send the, the verbs uh, in a couple of minutes. Y le voy a pedir que para mañana solamente nos aprendamos estos 10 verbos. Only these 10 verbs, pero así como aprendiditos al pie de la letra, right? Like pronunciation, meaning, and everything. Um, mañana les, les doy 10 más, all right? Or 20, si ustedes pueden con 20, right? Vamos a ver cómo les va con esos primeros. Uh, I can give you tomorrow either 10 or 20 para el día lunes, for Monday. Porque ya que tenemos el fin de, you know, you can work a little bit more. Uh, and then by Tuesday, agregamos 10 más. By Wednesday, agregamos 10 más. Because at the end, no necesitan 200 verbos para comunicarse al pasado. You don't really need them. Pero si hay como alrededor de 40, 50 verbos que son los más utilizados en pasado, right? Y esos nos tenemos que memorizar los verbos al pie, you know, like, like tenerlos acá súper frescos. So, vamos little by little. Eh, no les voy a mandar una lista de 300 verbos because probably no los van a ver, eh, nunca los van a utilizar. But I'm going to send you eh, like around. Primero comenzamos con los primeros 10. Let's start with the first 10, los más usados. Si les pido, guys, que nos memorizamos esos verbos, that we memorize them. Uh, so tomorrow we start practicing them. Y luego 10 más para lunes, 10 para martes, and so forth. Um, recordemos que mañana es el último día para la plataforma eh, de la unidad 1 y unidad 2. Gracias a quienes ya avanzaron, a quienes ya la terminaron. You know, I was like, wow, I'm super happy. These guys are amazing. So gracias a quienes ya avanzaron, you know, y ya la completaron. Eh, si les queda un par de minutitos y pueden avanzar con el resto de unidades, háganlo, no hay ningún problema, right? De esa forma ustedes se quitan un peso de encima and, y ya no están con la presión de, ay, tengo que terminarla, tengo que terminarla, right? Uh, people, questions, preguntas, dudas, anything you would like to add? No? Nothing? Okay, Next so... Question. Okay, great, that sounds good. So en un par de minutitos les envío eh, los 10, solamente 10 verbos para mañana, verbos irregulares, all right? And uh, los practicamos tomorrow. We'll be practicing that tomorrow. Thanks everybody, I'll be seeing you tomorrow. Have a good night. Bye-bye. Bye, -bye. Good night, teacher. Bye, teacher. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye.